Uh, this is such an interesting range. This is Herbal Essentials. I'm gonna just absolutely fire out my favorites and the ones to look at. A lot of it is essential oil based, so that's not necessarily for me, but the hydrating products that are loaded with the mineral waters and the Himalayan salts, I think are fab. Look at the micellar water. If you've never used a micellar water before, again, it's a French tradition. This is a really lovely one. I love the packaging. It's very simple, very straightforward. If you use a micellar water, please obviously remember to rinse it off at night. But again, if you're traveling, if you are, I mean, if you're on a staycation, if you've managed to get away to a festival or you're camping, a micellar water is absolutely important. Just make sure that afterwards you go over your skin with a little bit of just mineral water or, or clear water. You just need to take those micellar particles, which are essentially detergents off your skin. There are little Revival eye masks, which I really love. They're the ones that are actually shaped to go under the eye. Again, loaded with mineral waters, plus humectants to deliver water into the skin. You will notice the skin plump up straight away. It's a temporary effect, but it's a great product to try. There are two other products that I want to mention. There's the illuminating mask, which you leave on for like five to 10 minutes and rinse off and it's loaded with shea butter and humectants. So it's fairly rich, better suited for a drier skin. But for me, the standout product is the Photo Finish Face Veil, and it's what I've got on today. Now, it's actually a moisturizer, but it, I love it. It's super lightweight, it's that gel cream, it's a really lovely size, but it's got a sort of soft focus finish to it. But if I show it to you, you're not gonna be surprised. It's my standout lightweight gel moisturizer for the summer, and it's got a very slight soft focus effect to it um, and it's plumping as well. So I, I think that the minerals in this case are being used also as a soft focus sort of blurring primer effect. It says it's a blurring primer but I actually just think it's a fab moisturizer. I really do. I just think it's a really nice product. To me, smells completely on fragrance which is what I like. The illuminating mask, the micellar water, to me there's no trace of heavy fragrance in them at all. Uh, go and have a look at this range. It's in Superdrug. It's really reasonably priced. It's a brand that I think is really interesting to watch. It's all about hydration. And that makes sense to me that you just want to deliver as much water into the skin as possible. So what I've chosen is the non-oil products that I think are the standout hero ones.